Hi everyone, I hope you all are doing great in your life. So in this video, I'm just gonna be sharing you some tricks to get those interview calls. So basically, I've been getting two, three interview calls daily and it's not a lie and I'm not exaggerating it. What exactly happening is that I don't usually get every day, but four to five days in a week, I get two, three calls. So considering that I get uh, 10, 12 calls in a week, and this happens to me and I'm not even looking for a job change but yes uh, that matters ki I should get interview calls if I am applying to certain positions in uh, India or be it abroad so I should get interview calls but most of you have this query that you are not getting those interview calls and you are suffering from like six months or uh, one year you have been applying multiple jobs and you are still not getting that one single interview call and it could be very frustrating I know that feeling I have been through it and I know that even if you don't get a chance to get interviewed how would you feel like uh, you have acquired so many skills you have wor worked so hard and you have done everything that is needed but you are not getting an interview call for one opportunity that you have been looking for from a very long time so I know the pain and yes I would be very transparent in this video I would not uh, sell anything and I would not try to like ex exaggerate that you, whether you will get 10, 15 calls every day and things like that. But after a passage of time, if you do these things for a month or so, I'll say you will start getting interview calls. And that is the motto of this video. I just want to help someone who is a fresher or someone who doesn't know about the industry, how it works, how LinkedIn works, how Nokri works. So this is uh, just a video. Please watch it till, till the end because there are a lot of information that you may miss out and I don't want you to miss out. And yes, let's start but before starting i would want to tell you whoever is new on my channel so my name is somya and i have been working in the industry for over four years and i have been a salesforce analyst from last two years before that i have worked with companies like infosys and right now i'm working with arcsa which is a product-based company so yeah this is about my introduction so let's go back into the video so there are five things that i want to tell you and first is your visibility and your profile so LinkedIn is a very vast space and so is Nokri. So what you have to do is you have to maintain a certain profile. So if you look over here, these are my profiles on LinkedIn as well as Nokri. So what exactly makes it different from your profile? So this profile does not look like a ghost profile. I'll tell you why. If you are on LinkedIn and you have only 10, 15 connections and you are applying to jobs randomly, easy applies, so many easy applies and you think that you will get that interview call from those easy applies. Okay. But this is how it doesn't work. Whenever you search someone on LinkedIn, you see their profile. And whenever you see their profile, you know, okay, this person works on AWS. This person works on further clouds such as SAP, Salesforce, Azure, things like that. So your profile should look like certain profile that has a credibility, that has something that recruiters see and grasp their attention. So whether you are into any industry, just be it more just make it more specific like i'm into salesforce so you see whatever i have done on salesforce whatever certification i have acquired whatever skills i have in salesforce or similar to the skills that are needed as an analyst in the salesforce industry or be it any industry so listed over here this is how my profile looks like so i want you to focus on that so improve your visibility so see how many people search me on LinkedIn so this is because that I have been posting about Salesforce or I have been posting certain things about my domain and my knowledge on LinkedIn so that is why I have certain people that are actually searching for me so this is the reason your visibility is really important number two early applications so whenever you see a job post on LinkedIn, you immediately hit apply. But did you ever see that how many days this application has been existed and how many applicants it has on LinkedIn? So if it, it is more than 100 plus, do not apply it. I'll tell you why. If HR already got 100 plus applications and sometimes it's even in thousands, so they would not consider your application. What they will do is they just um, skip it. So if you're an early applicant, what you have to do is just filter out on LinkedIn past 24 hours. So in the past 24 hours, if any job has been posted related to your domain, related to the job you have been searching, this is going to work there. So this trick is extremely important. That's why I get daily calls. Like whenever a, a recruiter searches, use my profile. Okay. So do that thing, which is very most important in, in my list. And even if you are an early applicant, just skip this part also. So there is an, another thing that you have to do is the jobs that have really less applicants. So if the job has really less applicants, such as you see the job like this, 
you can also apply to this because no like lesser number of pe people have applied to it and hrs are more likely to call you so these are two things that i have mentioned and so third topic is career portal like applying on career portal increases your chances so if you apply directly on any career portal of company let let's say it's ey or deloitte or be it infosys wipro cognizant any company and if if you just go and search their career portal such as search uh, infosys career portal and open the jobs there for example you are searching a job in the aw associate roles and just search over there and apply there you will see there are very less number of applicants there and the chances of getting the interview calls from the company portal which is very authentic and you, which is not even fake there are jobs that are fake on linkedin as well as on nokri so you will not be scammed when you directly apply to their career portal and i have seen this thing that your application considered more whenever you apply on career portal because recruiters also think that you are genuine person who took some time to apply for this because the hiring process is little bit tougher there so yes apply on the career portal 10 to 15 jobs daily apply and you will see the magic in one month now the fourth part is getting a referral if you think that you found a job and the job id is there on the job post mention over there either on linkedin or their career portal or anywhere you found it and you have a friend who works there or you have made certain connection on linkedin that came out to be really fruitful and you just message them and ask them whether uh, they would provide the, them the referral why would they do that they'll also get money to get uh, like if you are selected they'll also get the money for uh, getting a certain someone placed in their company so think of that way that you are asking someone but they are also getting something in return so do not hesitate and just ask for referral from many people as you can so do this thing also and this thing genuinely works every time i got a referral i got an interview call the fifth thing that i would like to mention over here is just search on linkedin and search hiring and follow as many people as you can and then you will see that they kind of post whatever job profile that you are looking for and hiring in salesforce hiring in sap hiring in aws you can search things like that and there would be certain recruiters that are hiring and what you have to do is just follow each of them and daily they like kind of create certain posts such as uh, they are hiring for this person they are hiring for this role so just comment interested and also try cold emailing just create a template for cold emails like, such as whatever your profile is your profession proficiency your skills everything create a cold email and just mail them on linkedin or like uh, directly through their ma mail id so if you can do that thing also works so yeah this was it for this video if you find things useful just uh, follow me or like this video i would i would highly appreciate your time so yeah this was it for this video we'll meet you next time bye bye